It's December in Thailand and it's cold in the morning. Especially if you're in the mountains and if you're on a, in a rural area and you're not surrounded by concrete, it tends to get quite cold during the night, down to 15 degrees, 16 degrees. Maybe we'll have 12 degrees. It's really cold if you don't have any form of like heating only like hot water when you shower so you need to bring your hot clothes or your your headwear or some something and what I want to talk about today is how to handle your clothes when you're in Thailand in Thailand the moisture goes up to up to 100 percent moisture during the night it starts getting quite moist at 5, 6, 7 um, o'clock in the afternoon and then it's uh, quite moist until 7, 8, 9, uh, 10 in the morning. So what you do is you wash your clothes in the morning and then hang it out and then it will dry from 10 in the before noon to 3, 4 o'clock and when it's dry, 3, 4 o'clock, you put it in a, a dry bag if you're in a camp or you you put it, you pack it in your backpack or something. But a dry bag is good because if your clothes is dry and you put it here and you make it a compact dry bag, you, your clothes will be dry. If you come to the camp, the vegan camp, you can uh, ask us to order one for you. The most difficult time to get your clothes to dry is during the rain season. So from May, end May to end September or something is the hardest because the moisture is so high and there's quite a lot of rainfall and you really need to find the spots of time where it's really really hot and the sun is out during the the rainy season but sometimes you can be lucky and you can have m almost a month without rain or and or only like showers very like rapid showers and almost all the time it's uh, the sun is shining so it's really 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 sometimes really random but in the dry season it's quite not easy to get your clothes dry although it's December and it's cold during the night it will get very hot <laughs> during the day it will be 30 degrees or something <laughs> so I enjoy the, the this time like December January February a lot because it's not so uh, it's not super hot and it's like cold and hot and you can yeah the only thing is that at some point when it hasn't rained for three months or four months you start to miss the rain 